Good morning, West Ottawa. I'm Sarah. And I'm Aaliyah. Today we have some announcements about clubs, wall stock, and spring sports. So I'm going to be going to the University of Minnesota next year and I'm planning on studying interior design um, at the College of Design there and we'll also be incorporating some interior architecture into the program. So I'll also be able to design hospital wings and larger industrial spaces uh, as well as like um, smaller homes or apartments. So WPN has helped me to work with other people which is definitely what I'll be doing a lot with interior design. It's a lot of work with other, um, with clients and with other designers. I've always loved being able to be creative and express myself through drawing and painting. I like to work with watercolor too, but that's harder to control than acrylic. I would say that my style of art, um, a lot of it is portraiture. I like to draw figures. And that's all we have for you today. Have a good week. I like lacrosse because um, I really like the team. We have a lot of fun together and it's a really interesting sport and it's fun to play. I love lacrosse because the team is awesome and the game is really fun. So I love lacrosse because um, I love the people um, and my team especially and I just love to win too. So if you want to join lacrosse next year, I totally encourage it. Fallen for Bryce will be a 3-on-3 three -three basketball tournament on Saturday, May 18th at 9 a.m. It will be $20 and all proceeds will go to the Bryce Thomas Memorial Scholarship. Well, Panthers will start tweeting stuff and we just hope to see you all out there. Have a tremendous day, West Ottawa. May the forest be with you. Um, do you maybe want to go to Snowball with me? Um, I'll think about it. Well, time is ticking.
working because Snowball's on the 26th, so... Well, of course I'll go with you! Because every time we touch, I get this feeling And every time we kiss, I swear I can fly Can't you feel my heart beat fast? I want this to last Need you by my side You should come to Wolfstock because it's two nights of good fun. You can hang out with your friends, listen to some good music. And it all goes to uh, support kids over in countries less fortunate than us. I'm definitely going to Wostock this year. It was a lot of fun last year. Um, I met some new friends and discovered a new band, so definitely come out. Hi, I'm Taylor Schott, and I like to make art. Um, I like to do art because I've always loved being able to be creative and express myself through drawing and painting. My favorite mediums to work with are acrylic paint and just regular drawing. Um, I like to work with watercolor too, but that's harder to control than acrylic. I would say that my style of art, um, a lot of it is portraiture. I like to draw figures and people and faces just because everyone can be done differently and I really like being able to portray the personality and character of um, the people that I draw and paint. This is another one of my favorite pieces. Um, I went to Chicago a couple years ago and was really inspired by the architecture that they have in the city. And then this piece um, inspired me to create this bigger painting here um, with a little bit more color but still the same design on the buildings with the lines. The more you practice and the more that you work with art, the better you're going to get at it and the more invested you're going to become in uh, your interest in art. So next year I will be studying art at Stamps School of Art and Design at the University of Michigan and I'm pursuing a BFA in um, visual art so it's like a general degree in studio and fine art and I'm really excited and looking forward to it. So I'm going to be going to the University of Minnesota next year and I'm planning on studying interior design um, at the College of Design there. If you're wondering what an interior designer does, I'll be learning how to, um, yes, coordinate colors and um, swatches and stuff like that. It's not just about um, just the look of a building but like the environment and the safety of a building. And we'll also be incorporating some interior architecture into the program. So I'll also be able to design hospital wings and larger industrial spaces, uh, as well as like um, smaller homes or apartments. I'm really excited to go to the University of Minnesota because I'll be able to have a smaller community at the design school. I'll also be able to participate in intramural sports, Greek life, Christian groups, all that stuff. Um, and I'm just really looking forward to it. So WPN has helped me to work with other people, which is definitely what I'll be doing a lot with interior design. It's a lot of work with other, um, with clients and with other designers. So that's an important skill. I actually have a YouTube channel called Siblings Travel. So it's all of my vacations and my family likes to travel a lot, as you've kind of seen in the intro. So yeah, subscribe. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, West Ottawa. I'm Sarah. And I'm Aaliyah. Today we have some announcements about clubs, 
Wostock, and Spring Sports. What's better than spreading positivity on your fine Monday morning? Let's check it out. Shout out to Sonara Castillo for always being there for everyone and being so kind. My positive thoughts are the senior girls basketball players, Aaliyah, Abby, Rachel, Natalie, and Danny. Shout out to Caitlin, Ashlyn, and Andrea for being my best friends. Shout out to Brittany and Aaliyah, you know, always there for me, you know, close friends, forever and always. Go well. Thanks, Connor, for being my twin. I love the community at West Ottawa and how diverse it is and how kind everyone is to one another. It really feels like a family, and we're all in this together. I'd like to shout out to my best friend, Jalen, because he is amazing, and he always makes me laugh every single day. As a teacher, something that I love to see is students that smile back at me when I say hi. Shout out to Miss Andreatis for always giving me food. Class. Shout out to Coach Ashnod for being one of the best coaches this school had ever have. I would just like to appreciate this whole entire school for just making me so happy, especially you, Mrs. Bullheis. Creative Writing Club is in A149 every Thursday from 3 to 4 p.m. to write stories, poems, plays, anything you like. If you have any questions, see Miss Engel or Mr. Wilkinson for more information. Wopong is back in actions, Thursdays from 3 to 4 in the North Cafeteria. No experience, paddles, or commitment required. We are a drop-in, come-as-you-are club. So if you have any questions, contact Miss, Mrs. Heemstra in A203 or Wopong President Alec B. Calling all colors, meeting on Thursday from 3 to 4. Wostock is coming soon on March 22. It's Competitive dance team auditions for the 2019 through 2020 season are Wednesday and Thursday, March 13th and 14th, 6 to 9 p.m. in the North Building Dance Room. Anime Club is in Mrs. Wilcox room A261 on the second floor of the North Building on Thursdays from 3 to 4 p.m. Come to watch anime, play games, and find new friends who love the genre. Robotics meetings are being held at the Bot Cave, South 612 area, every Tuesday and Thursday from 6 to 8 p.m. Please join us. Classes running right now are Programming, Build and Awards, slash PR. Come to the meetings and we, we will guarantee we'll find a job for you. K-Pop Club meets Thursdays in room A108 from 3 to 4 o'clock. Hey, Wo, well, are you interested in catching up on your homework in chemistry or studying for that upcoming test in econ? Well then, Wo well, Access could be a great place for you. Wo well, Access is back upon this semester from 3 to 4 p.m. in the North Library on Mondays and Wednesdays. National Honor Society students as volunteer tutors, teachers, coffee, snacks, and free Wi-Fi are available to help you complete your classwork each session. Stop by after school on a Monday or Wednesday to complete your schoolwork or sign up to attend a session in the future at bit.ly slash woeaccess. Greta made a teacher appreciation video on Mr. Taylor. Let's check it out. I appreciate Mr. Taylor because he has a great sense of humor. I appreciate Mr. Taylor because he's enthusiastic and funny. I appreciate Mr. Taylor because he always makes everyone laugh. I appreciate Mr. Taylor because he's dope and he's cool. I appreciate Mr. Taylor because he's funny. I appreciate Mr. Taylor because he's really funny and he's very enthusiastic and he's very understanding, but by far the funniest teacher I've ever had, besides Mrs. Wilcock, but definitely very close. <laughs> Boys Volleyball is returning this spring. There are more teams this year and more competition. If you are interested in learning more or what it's all about, come to the quick informational meeting.
Thursday, February 28th, after school in Mr. Burke's room, 128 in the South. All girls planning on trying out for soccer this spring should look for details regarding tryouts on the Woe Girls Soccer Google Classroom page. The Google code is 2EIP2VN. If you are not yet a member of the class, any questions, contact Coach Wyckoff. Tryouts begin Monday, March 11. Thanks to the Community Foundation of the Holland Zealand, the College Advisors will be taking students to Michigan State University on March 13. Admitted seniors and academically fit juniors are given priority. Pick up your permission slips in the North or South Advisors office. There are also a few leftover spots for the Central Michigan University trip on March 20th. There will be a tennis meeting for all interested in playing girls tennis this spring. Meet after school on Thursday, February 28th in Mr. Swallier's room, A229. Attention girls interested in playing softball. There will be an informational meeting to go over tryout times as well as other information during seminar on Thursday, March 7th in room A206. If you are interested in trying out and playing this year, please attend the meeting. If you cannot make it, email Coach Walworth at walworthn at westottawa.net so she can get you the needed information. And that's all we have for you today. Have a good week. Pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, West Otto. I'm Logan. I'm Sarah. Testing week is in the past. Let's look to the future. Today we've got all the news on Girls Soccer Purple Power Tropical Smoothie Fundraiser. We'll be right back. and I play basketball. My favorite thing about basketball is I like to make bat make some baskets and I like like I like having fun with the other team. My warm up for this is I can like I could do like running and and jumping. So I finished second place in a, the final basketball game. I feel like like I am happy when I win. I like lacrosse because um, I really like the team. We have a lot of fun together, and it's a really interesting sport, and it's fun to play. I love lacrosse because the team is awesome and the game is really fun. So I love lacrosse because um, I love the people um, and my team especially and I just love to win too so if you want to join lacrosse next year I totally encourage it. Seniors, graduation is just around the corner. Register now for Jungle by submitting your paperwork and check for $100 to either office. Help is available to pay for Jungle for seniors who need it. If you are registered by April 16th, you will be able to sign up to ride the bus with your friends. Don't delay any longer. Prom 2019 is quickly approaching. A Night Under the Stars will be hosted at Grand Rapids Public Museum on Friday, April 26th from 8 to 11 p.m. Tickets will go on sale starting Monday, April 15th in both buildings during both lunches. Ticket cost is $30 per person and includes parking, coat check, and a little extra fun at prom. 
Want to experience different cultures, try new foods, watch performances, and have a good time? Come to Woe's first cultural festival on April 19th from 5 to 8 p.m. in the North Cafeteria. It's a special experience that you don't want to miss. From Cambodia to India to Germany and many others, you'll get to discover the world from the convenience of the high school. Hope to see you there. We are looking for performers for Senior Oscar Night. There is a Google form sent to all seniors that you can fill out for any type of talent that you can perform at Senior Oscar Night on May 10, such as singing, dancing, or comedy acts. The Regional Science Olympiad Tournament was held at GVSU on Saturday, March 23. All three WOSO teams advanced to the state finals. For the high school, this marks our 17th straight playoff bid. The high school finished 7th overall and medaled in 11 events. Congratulations! The state finals are at MSU on April 27th. Just a reminder that the South Choir and Dunes Hallway is always closed to students, unless you're a choir or Dunes student. You need to exit out the South Building through Main Street or the Odyssey Ware Hallway. Wednesday, April 17th at 6 p.m., come to the South Cafeteria for the Lynx Talent Show. There will be many different talents and food. The May AP and IB exam schedule has been posted on the WOHS website. Your AP and or IB teacher will provide you with the link to the full schedule. You must know the date, time, and location of your exam. Late arrivals are not allowed to enter the testing room, and rescheduling is not guaranteed. All testing students will be required to present a valid ID in order to enter the testing room. All students taking AP exams in May are required to attend a mandatory bubbling session on Thursday, April 18th in the North Cafeteria. Bring a number two pencil. Students with South Third Hour need to leave class at 10.15 and go immediately to the North Cafe. Students with North Third Hour need to leave class at 10.20. Contact Mrs. Van Dam, the AP coordinator, if you have any questions. Muskegon Community College will be here April 17th, 1 p.m. See Mrs. G at the North Reception Desk with any questions, or if you're interested. Hey West Ottawa, would you like to make the world a more peaceful place? Is respecting one's culture important to you? If yes, then come to Calling on Colors on April 25th. See Mrs. Watkins in South or Mr. Houlihan in North for more information. Prom season is here! Don't forget to order your corsages and boutonnieres from Glenda's Lakewood Floral. When you order your flowers from Glenda's Lakewood Floral, mention Woe Jungle and they will donate to Jungle. Order today! The LEGO Club is meeting on April 15th from 3 to 4 p.m. in room A108. Snacks will be provided. Feel free to drop in at any time for a free build or just to say hi and check things out. Girls Varsity Soccer Team is holding a fundraiser at Tropical Smoothie Cafe on Wednesday, April 17th, all day long. Mention that you are there for Girls Soccer Purple Power. Starting today, you can give your money to whoever senior you want to see get pied in the face at our Purple Power Soccer game on Friday. Hey, teachers! Hey! Teachers! Teachers, you will receive this email on Monday. I don't know when, but sometime on Monday. And it's, it's a pretty good email that you should read because it has a lot of information you want to know in it. So, yeah. Make sure you wear your jeans on Wednesday. Make sure you read through this email because there is a lot of information you want to know. That's all we have for today. Have a great Monday. I got the